Content marketing has become one of the biggest marketing trends of 2012. And this year, 2013, it has been predicted that this is the year of the online writer. So content is important and you should add this to your marketing plan. So when we talk about content marketing, this doesn't only pertain to content that you have created yourself. And this also means um, marketing or sharing other people's content. Now, one of my favorite uh, sites for curating content is Storify. And I have been addicted to creating stories on Storify. You can find a lot of great content from other people that you can share with your audience. Now, this is my Storify profile. And let me just show you really quick how it looks like okay so it just looks like a social network um, you have your picture here links to your website to your Twitter and your Facebook profile and your description and you can also have followers and you can follow other people who have storify profiles and I currently have three stories here I have content marketing tips productivity tips for entrepreneurs and online marketing tidbits on the top right portion just click on create story okay so I did this earlier and let's just finish this the first step is to enter a headline so I am currently curating tips from virtual assistants so we can name this virtual assistant tips and tricks so this can be this can apply to virtual assistants or people who want to work with virtual assistants. So after um, entering your headline here, you can then add your description. And the next step is to enter a keyword on this box right here. So you have options in here so you can find different types of content from Twitter, Tweet, Facebook, YouTube, Flickr, Instagram, um, Google, and you can even um, embed a URL here. And so let's just start with Twitter. So click on the Twitter icon and you can opt to remove or uncheck links and retweets. So I prefer to curate content that doesn't have any links. So I just want plain text uh, tips. So let's type, say, VA tip. Since this is a hashtag that I have noticed that has really great content. Okay, so you will be able to see results on this side on the right on the right side so you will see these text these po these posts from people so if you see something that you like to add to your story you can easily drag them over to the left now once you have finished um collecting different stories from these social networks. So once you're done with that, you can then publish, click on publish. So let's type a description here, a collection of tips for virtual assistants and business owners who want to work with virtual assistants. Okay, so since that is ready, all you have to do is click on publish. And now the story has been saved and it has been published. And you have to wait. Okay, so there you go. And once you have finished publishing this, you will see this pop up uh, window asking you to share or notify the people that you have um, whose tweets you have added to your story. So you can edit this tweet here. So it says virtual assistant tips and tricks. So this starts with the headline of your story followed by the shortened URL of your story. 
and some hashtags here and you can even add your own hashtag so you can uh, decide whether you want to post this on Twitter or Facebook and I will show you later on how to um, set up your social networks on your Storyfy profile so the second step is to tell people that you know their tweets or their status updates or their content was featured on your Storyfy story so you can also edit this one and just take note of the character limit and you are shown these people here so all you need to do is click on each of these uh, users here and click publicize so they will know that they have been coded in your story and publicize you can see these functions on the top you can export this to external sites on WordPress self-hosted and wordpress.com sites on tumblr on Drupal sites and posters and on MailChimp which is amazing so you have to uh, select the service that your site is using and then click on export and for the notify option I've also um, I've already told you about this so you can edit the status update and post this on your Twitter and Facebook profiles then the next is if you want to make changes to this you can just edit um, click on the edit link here now for these four options here the heart icon is serves as a like button so this is similar to Facebook if you click on the heart icon this means you liked your own story and your visitors can also click on this so this um, that will show up on uh, their social networks that they have that they have liked your story and then the next um, icon here is for comments so you can click on this and comment on your own um, story then the next is click is to click on share and you will be able to share this story on Facebook Twitter Google Plus LinkedIn and even email this to your friends so this is amazing and the last option here is to embed so let's click on this and you have the option to select a template so you can go with the default or the slideshow template so I prefer the default since it shows you um, the story on your website so I will show you uh, later on so I prefer not to show the header and the border so since we love you know we uh, we want this to be found on uh, Google so I um, checked include HTML for SEO so that is important so once you have finished choosing the options here click on the embed code and copy this and open uh, a new post on your WordPress blog and embed it on the HTML okay so earlier I mentioned about um, setting up your social networks so you will be able to post uh, your stories on Twitter and Facebook so next right next to your username find settings and on the left hand side click on connections okay so you will be able to connect your um, social networks the available social networks are Twitter Facebook Google and Instagram and Foursquare so I hope you have found this tutorial helpful and I really encourage you to start curating stories from Storyfy and engage in conversations with a lot of users so I'll see you next week for another teach me Tuesday video